everyone, Skeeter Yamaha Pro Brandon Polinick here, and I'm going to introduce you guys to the 2021 Skeeter Apex Edition of the FXR. Now, what does that mean? It comes with some upgraded standard features, one of those being the color options. It comes with five exclusive colors, one of those being this color option number four, which has the Tri Tech color. This is True Blue Tri Tech. And as you get closer, you can really notice those colors start to pop inside of this blue. Besides just looking good on the water, it also performs better on the water. This is a completely redesigned hole for Skeeter in 2020, and they have added some more features in 2021. So you've got that dead rise that's gonna help with that rough water. You've got that wider beam that's gonna allow more stability. So when you're out there in the water, not only do you notice it when you're fishing, but also when you're driving this boat. So all of those things that make you feel more comfortable behind the wheel or while you're fishing come standard with the Hambies Keel Guard Skeeter Built Trailer. Extremely durable coat. Comes standard with steps up front so it's easy when you're loading or unloading the boat or if you just want to get inside the boat. And then it also comes standard with this side step built into the trailer so that it's easy to access in and out of the boat. That's a huge deal to be able to access all of your tackle, rods and reels from outside the boat. As we move back, you've got the fiberglass fenders as well as well-placed steps with grip. And then the Apex Edition comes with the standard wheels with extra bead guard as well as dual tandem axle brakes. So you've got all the stopping power you need and you're gonna be able to perform and look good in your brand new Skeeter. As we move to the bow of the boat, you really get to see some of the standard features that stand out in the Apex Edition. One of those being the Minn Kota Ultrex 112 pound thrust iPilot link system that comes with built-in sonar. Not only is it your 2D traditional sonar, but you get built-in mega DI. And with the iPilot link system, not only can you control your trolling motor with the iPilot remote, but you can also control it with your Humminbird Helix units that come standard. It comes standard with Helix 12s. So these are all gonna be gimbal mounted. You get the spot lock technology, everything. You've got your trim switches, all of your light switches up here that are easy accessible. And as we move up to the front, one of my favorite Skeeter features actually is the straps that they use and built into their boats. You've got standard deck lighting and you've also got standard locker bar features. So it's gonna be a bar, goes all the way across, locks down your compartments so nobody can get in your compartments. Two storage compartments for your rods. And then you've also got a center storage, store your net also, same lighting as your deck lighting. And then it's got the modular fishing compartments and trays that allow you to remove and replace with all of your tackle. So you could easily keep one for shallow water, one for deep water, nice and easy to use. And then the day box, which is one of my favorite features because it allows me to fill this with things that I may use that day. And it's quick and easy and I'm saving time on the water with that day box. So we'll continue and we'll move back toward the back of the boat and get into some more standard features. Back here at the console, one of the most convenient things is this flip up cooler that's fully insulated. We've got added cup holders as well as these designed seats that are wider platform, softer, and then it also comes with these handles built in. And as we transition around the side, you can see we've got the Apex Edition stereo system, co-angler or your team partner rod storage there. We've got this integrated glove box. It does come available in a dual console version where your glove box would then be inside that dual console. We've got the front deck step and storage system for your tools, pliers, scissors, things like that comes standard with your ruler, as well as an easy to use garbage can. And then as we move right behind the console, comes standard with the upgraded TH sliding hot foot tiltable steering wheel, blinker trim tabs, one for 
our Atlas jack plate and one also for the show to be able to trim the Yamaha up and down. Our other Helix 12 networked to the front graph. Also, you can upgrade this to a Solex if you would like. And then we've got full digital gauges. So we've got analog and digital gauges actually. On the right side, digital, you can swap through. You can see your RPMs, your fuel, your fuel consumption, your full Skeeter panel that's going to control all of your lights, your live wells, all those different things. And then we've actually got the flow right drain plug. Simple switch, drain plug pulls in, you're good to go. Also closes our live wells. You've got your control panel over here for your Bluetooth stereo. And then we've also got switches for our OxyMax, which is in our live well system. We'll talk about that in a second. But then also our dry dock system that is going to reduce any of that mildew or moisture that can happen inside of your compartments, right? And then we've also got a charging system over here. It's a monitor system. It shows you how the levels of your starting battery and your trolling motor batteries are. So you can monitor that throughout the day or monitor as it's charging at night. And then we've also got this awesome little dock cleat right here that allows you to quickly and easily tie up to the dock. Incredible standard features back here in the console. Hop back on the back deck and keep moving our way back showing you the awesome standard features of this Apex Edition. This is arguably, as a tournament angler, one of the most important features on a bass boat, and that is your live well system. You've got your two live well compartments, each one having its own fill and recirculation pump. And then you've also got the OxyMax or the oxygenators. And then as well on our back compartments, you've got two more storage access compartments, easy to get into. And then we will actually hop out of the boat. As we move all the way to the stern of the boat, you really get the opportunity to see how clean this bilge area is. Gunnel to gunnel, clean and easy access to all of your batteries, all of your bilge pumps, things like that. You've got a removable tray here that you can add any tools or maybe your motor toter to. Uh, you can take in and out. You've got your three trolling motor batteries. As you can see, all the wiring is very clean, tucked away and ran neatly from the factory. As we move across, you've got the Minn Kota Precision Charger that is going to charge your batteries correctly. You continue across, you've got your one starting battery or your cranking battery that's gonna operate all of your live wells and lighting system and your motor. And continue across, you've got a nice raised platform that not only is raised for your batteries, but also your power pole pumps. And then you've got all of your fuses and your perco switch. Now what that perco switch is gonna do is it's gonna allow you to shut all the power off to the boat but then it also allows you to run normal operation and then also jump your cranking battery from your trolling motor battery. So you don't have to carry around jumper cables anymore. Flip of a switch, start your motor, pulse power from your trolling motor batteries, and you're on your way and good to go if you run into that situation. So as we talk about that clean wiring, not only does that transition from the inside of the boat, but also outside of the boat. As we move right here toward the center, you realize how clean all of your hydraulic steering, all of your wiring for your transducers and your power poles are. Integrated clamshell that is wider, you're not jamming all those wires in there. So that really allows us to have better running components. All of our jack plates, all of that wiring is clean, easy to access, and then we will continue. And let's talk about the very back of this boat back here with the Yamaha show. And all the way to the back end of the boat, you can see standard features, eight foot blades come attached to your standard 12 inch hydraulic jack plate from Atlas. And all of that attached to the Yamaha 250 SHO, the most reliable, highest performing motor out there on the water right now. So everything that you have seen today is all standard features for the 2021 Skeeter FXR Apex Edition. If you guys want more information, you wanna learn more about this boat, or if you wanna go take a test drive, get down to your local Skeeter dealer and go to skeeterboats.com, see what this boat is truly all about for yourself.